Hi there! You found us here at Storytime with Miss Becky. I'm Miss Becky, and this is our friend Bear, who loves to read along with you. Bear has a question for you. Have you ever had to solve the mystery of where you lost something? Like your other sock? <laughs> Bear thought so. Well, Annie and her dog Oscar need to solve the mystery of where Annie lost her other red mitten. Bear's asking if you will come and help us look for clues. Let's put on the magic reading glasses and solve this mitten mystery. Here we go. The Missing Mitten Mystery by Stephen Kellogg. Oscar, I lost my other mitten. That makes five mittens this winter. I'm in big trouble. Let's search every place we played today. We'll start at the hill where we rode on Ralph's sled. Here's Ralph's boot, but there's no mitten. I'll look around the castles we built with Ralph and Herbie and Ruth. That was fun. Here's Ralph's other boot and Ruth's sock and Herbie's sweater. But no mitten. Oscar, you found it. Wow, a flying mitten. Oh, it's only a little bird. I wonder if he stole my mitten to make a snuggly nest. No, he's too small to carry off a mitten. But an eagle could do it. Maybe an eagle took my mitten to keep his baby's head warm. Do you think my mitten got tired of being a mitten? Maybe it just slipped off my hand and hopped away. There are no mitten tracks, but here are some mouse tracks heading toward the wood pile. Could that mouse be using my mitten for a sleeping bag? Or maybe he'll wear it next Halloween and be a mitten mummy. Let's go see if I dropped my mitten while we were making the snowman to surprise Mrs. Seltzer. I haven't seen your mitten, Annie, but why don't you look in the garden where you were making snow angels? Finding missing mittens is hard work. It would be easier to grow new ones. Let's try planting the other mitten right here in the garden. Next spring, when the snow melts, a little mitten tree might sprout. Miss Seltzer and I would take good care of it all summer long. In the fall, we'd pick the ripe mittens. Then I'd give mittens on Christmas. and mittens on birthdays and mittens on Valentine's Day. Oscar, it's getting dark and it's starting to rain. We'll never find that mitten. Come inside, Annie. I made some hot chocolate for us. And I've got a biscuit for Oscar.
Look! The rain is melting the snowman. But what's that spot on his chest? Gracious! Your snowman has a heart! My mitten is the heart of the snowman! Bear's wondering, do you think solving mysteries can be hard work? <laughs> yes. Do you also think it can be fun work? Yes, sometimes, if you're not in a hurry. <laughs> well, Bear also wonders if you ever guessed that we discover Annie's red mitten as the red heart of the snowman. Bear also hopes you come back soon for more adventures in solving important mysteries. Bye for now. Please subscribe.